Activity 8 Listen to the following story. The bubble is beautiful, isn't it? There was a bubble tree in a forest. It had straight branches. It had long white thorns at the base of each leaf tail. One day, it looked at the leaves of other trees. The leaves had different shapes, round, narrow and broad. The bubble tree looked sadly at its leaves and thorns. It said to itself, My leaves are very small and unattractive. They are not like the cute leaves of other trees. And I hate my thorns too. One day we heard Bubbles' sad words. She appeared before it and said, Dear Babul, you look very upset. Babul said, Oh yes, I am. But why? asked one Devi. Because I don't like my tiny leaves. I should have golden leaves and no thorns at all. I think you have excellent leaves and thorns to protect yourself, said one Devi. But I should be good looking too. Please remove my thorns and bless me with golden leaves, requested the Babul. One Devi touched its trunk with her magic stick and disappeared. The next morning, the leaves of the Babul tree changed into shining golden leaves. It had no thorns at all. The Babul tree looked beautiful and very happy. But its happiness did not last long. Some people passing through the forest looked at this wonderful tree. They saw the golden leaves and started plucking them. The Babul tree begged. Please don't take my golden leaves. I love them. A man said, I'll sell the leaves and buy things for my family. Then they ran away happily with all the golden leaves. The babool tree looked ugly without leaves. The babool tree started weeping. After three days, one Devi appeared again and said, Dear Babool, why do you look so upset? Where are your golden leaves? I blessed you with golden leaves, didn't I? Yes. You did, but some people took away all my golden leaves. Now I think I should have sparkling glass leaves. Devi, don't forget to remove my thorns, said the babool tree. Sorry, but I feel that it may be risky said one Devi. That may be true, but the sparkling glass leaves will shine in the sunlight. I will look like a tree of light. Please do it for me, requested the babool tree. All right, as you wish, said one Devi. The kind one Devi touched the trunk of the babool tree 
once again with her magic stick. The next morning, the leaves of the babool tree changed into sparkling glass leaves. Alls, its happiness did not last long this time too. A stormy wind started blowing through the forest. It blew so hard that all the sparkling glass leaves of the babool tree broke into small pieces. The babool tree was ugly and leafless once again. The babool tree wept loudly. The stormy wind broke all my leaves. What shall I do? The one devi heard its sobs and appeared again. What happened again? Why are you crying? said one devi. The cruel wind broke all my glass leaves. Now, I must have broad and smooth green leaves. Only then I will be contented and happy, said the babool tree. Let's try that this time, said one devi and granted babool's wish. The next morning, the babool tree had broad and smooth green leaves and no thorns. It was full of joy. Wow! What beautiful leaves I have! Robbers won't steal them. The cruel strong wind can't break them. Now I'll be handsome and happy forever. All of a sudden, there came three goats. They were very hungry. They saw the broad and soft green leaves of the babool tree. They ran to it and started eating its leaves. Ouch! Ouch! Goats! Please don't eat my leaves! cried the babool tree. The goats replied, We are very hungry. Your leaves are very tender and tasty. We will eat them all. The goats ate up all the leaves of the babool tree. They felt happy and contented. The babool tree was in tears again. It cried loudly. Oh, one devi, please save me. One devi appeared again with a smile on her face. Oh, dear Babool, I granted all your wishes, but still you are not happy and satisfied. Now, I will give you the last chance. Tell me, what do you wish? The babool said to one devi, Now, I have learnt a lesson. I don't want any golden leaves, glass leaves or broad soft leaves. I want to be a real babool tree. Please, Give me back my leaves and long white thorns. I will always be happy and contented with them. The one devi gave it back its small green leaves and thorns. Then the babool tree stood happily in its original evergreen dress forever.